Hi everybody, this is Maria Dolan, Marketing Director for Harbor Crossings. Today we're looking at 31 Lewis Avenue. This is a two bedroom, two bath home, manufactured home in Harbor Crossings manufactured home community. It's a land lease community. This was October 14th when the house arrived and the first two pictures show you a couple uh, days later, the men already had the skirting put on the house. I'll do an updated video of this house, but this is the day the house arrived and we will also look inside and take a sneak peek. So stay tuned for that portion of the tour inside the house. So we have a series of four houses that are going to be arriving on Lewis Avenue. This house is 31 Lewis Avenue. And this one is a beautiful blue siding and white shutters. I'm going to zip through the arrival as we had some difficulty making the turn, but there was great help and our skilled driver was able to maneuver. So Harbor Crossings is located at the crossroads of the Garden State Parkway and the Black Horse uh, Pike and Fire Road. We're really in a fabulous location. Across the street is a Wawa and on the other side is a super Walmart and a great um, strip mall area with plenty of shopping. So here you see the four lots and we'll be receiving one house at a time. Still working on making that turn. Oh, that's touch. Touch and go, but they've never had a problem. I'm always impressed. There's our flyer. All right, now you see the foundation and the two parking spots and the patio. Here you see your water and your sewer connections underneath the house. So when a house arrives, we have about a 38 checkpoint list and uh, much of it has to do with connecting the utilities, the electric, the water, the sewer, the gas. This is a natural gas uh, community and it is a city sewer and city water. There you see the circular parts in the concrete are the piers that go down beyond the frost line. We have a six inch slab um, on top of that and around that I should say and it's um, tiered I suppose I should use the word. Some parts of the pad are 12 inches and some are six inches. There's a whole science that Mr. Dolan follows for making the foundation of the house uh, you know, the best that he can. Mr. Dolan has been building manufactured homes in New Jersey for about 35 years, probably more now. Now they're disengaging the house and we'll take a sneak peek inside. Here you are looking in the living room at the kitchen, we've got a ceiling fan we have to put up. That's a guest closet there or co closet. Got a lot of boxes on the center of the living room that we have to um, assemble in the house. There's your front door. There's all the things. So that's furnace, the stack on the house, the lighting fixtures, anything that's fragile, they put there for us in the manufacturing facility for the 
guys to finish the construction when it arrives. It's about 80% done when it arrives, so we have work to do on our end. This house is uh, vinyl flooring throughout. Let's take a peek inside the coat closet. It's a great use of space. And the kitchen has so many cabinets. There's an extra pantry on the right side of the refrigerator. This is four stainless steel appliances, all Whirlpool appliances, dishwasher, microwave, stove, oven, and refrigerator. You've got a double bowl stainless sink. Here's a look for the area where you would keep your table and there's lighting above. This is the bronzite countertop with um, lots of variations of colors and the white cabinetry with the European pools. So the house goes um, on the highway with those rubber bands holding everything in place so that nothing gets jostled around. And then we'll come in and start making the house presentable. Here's a peek into the new dishwasher. The house arrives with paperwork on the counter and now we're going to take a peek to the adjustable shelves. All the appliances are strapped to protect them from shifting. A beautiful kitchen really sunny with that window there got a back door by the federal HUD code there has to be egress in case of a fire near the bedrooms so there's one door on either side here's a look at your upcoming neighbors this is a hundred amp electric panel There's a little nook here for a bench or shelving. You could do hooks. Here is the washer and dryer area. The manufacturer has never supplied washer and dryers. Each homeowner purchases their own. So this is the first bedroom and the first bathroom. You've got a one piece fiberglass tube seat shower stall. You've got a little window, you've got a framed mirror, the commode, the vanity, the porcelain sink. We have to install the glass shower door, the bypass door. Another view of the laundry area. And now we'll look at the first bedroom. Got LED lights in the ceiling throughout. When the house first arrives, the closet doors are also strapped to keep them from rattling during transportation. There's a metal wire rack for your closet. And here you have the serial number for the house. This is built by Champion. And this is the data plate with all of the information about each appliance. So Champion, this is a whole house water turn off in the closet conveniently located so that it's not underneath the house. So this is a champion home which is got many divisions and one of them is Redmond Homes built in Ephrata, Pennsylvania. And this is um, who we ordered this house from, the Redmond Manufacturing Facility in Ephrata, Pennsylvania. 
This is the second bathroom. This has a one piece fiberglass tub. Whenever we have two bathrooms in the house, we try to do one as a tub and one as a shower stall. That's got a transom window above and a cosmetic box, the framed mirror, commode, the vanity, the porcelain sink. We still have to put in all the light fixtures. They do all that after the house arrives. Here's your furnace. Again, it's rubber banded to protect the door during trans transit. We still have to put the doors on there. They were laying in the middle of the living room, again, to protect in transit. This is the second bedroom. And again, the closet doors are um, bound together so they don't um, rattle or get hurt in transit. So we'll be having three more houses just like this built next to. So this is 31 Lewis. We have 29 Lewis. 27 Lewis and 25 Lewis. I think they're all coming two weeks apart. And if you're interested in purchasing one of these homes, please go to our website and start the intake process by filling out the 15 pre-qualifying questions. Now we're going to run through some still photos of the house so you can uh, take a closer look at different areas.
Harbor Crossings is a Dolan Homes community owned by um, the Dolan family. We're a small family business. We've been in operation for almost 40 years now. This is Robert Dolan, who man is the managing member of Dolan Homes. We build innovative quality manufactured homes in our three New Jersey communities. In Edison Mobile Estates, Harbor Crossings, and Carteret Mobile Park. This is my husband, my nephew, and my son. This is our amazing crew. Everyone's on board to build you the most beautiful manufactured home. This is our maintenance team in Harbor Crossings. This is our construction team. Our community is um, a beautiful, safe location for having a home, making it affordable. Harbor Crossings pays the real estate taxes, so you're leasing the land, and we're building beautiful manufactured homes. This is my husband and myself. This is our office fronting Black Horse Turnpike. You can email us for an appointment. We see everybody by appointment only. This is our office. We have everybody go to the website where all the explanations, the process, and the available homes are listed. We're really proud of our location. We're in the downtown Egg Harbor Township area, just about to be redeveloped, which is called the Cardiff Redevelopment and it's going to encompass the whole um, area in which we are located and they'll be adding more sidewalks and better access to stores on the other side where the old Boscovs and the Harbor Square is located and it's a very exciting time to be in Egg Harbor Township. We're minutes from the beaches and great, great locations so come check us out. We can't wait to hear from you. There's our website. That's where you start.